Hey guys, uh, this is Arjun here, and today's topic is how we can make the chart more in charts or tables more interactive using the parameters, calculated fields, and sets. So here is a, a final visualizations. So the first one is showing is a, a, this regional level seeds. Uh, you can see the bar graph representing. And on the right side, I have uh, expand and collapse parameters, and I have a top 20 states parameters. So if, what I'll do, this is an, a collapse. Now, if I click on expand, what I'm getting is a regional level, each state sales a bar graph. Okay. So what this color is representing, the top, you can see the army color is in top and the green is another. So top is nothing but if I select here, if I uh, put any numbers that top states, so those top uh, states will be colored as army colors. Let's say if I take only 10 mains, so only 10 states, top 10 states are selected from overall regions. So this is how it is working. Let's get in how we can do this. So what I'll do first, I'll take region, then I'll take state, okay, and want the sales, and I'll do a bar graph, okay. Let's just swap this, okay. So now we are getting each state levels sales, right? So what I want is I want this to be expand and collapsed state. So what I'll do first, I'll create a parameters. Let's take a parameter and name it as expand and collapse. Okay. Just take a list over here and write expand and some float mode. Let's take string expand collapse. Okay, fine. So we have created a parameters to control the parameter. We need to create a calculated field now. So where we can create is create here calculated fields. We'll name it as expand bar collapse calc it's calculations. Okay, so here what I'm going to write uh, here is so if expand and collapse is equal to expand is equal to expand then give state detail else region else we need a region and we need to write it then here so if expand and collapse equal to expand then state level detail else region okay so now we'll what we'll do we'll state the static st uh, column state and replace with using this calculated field and let's bring this show param parameter right side it's an expand let's see if i click on collapse okay fine uh, so now we need to create that top 10 top states not a calculated first we'll create a pa uh, parameters so create a parameter name it as top states so here we need to take integer because it's a number this fine okay so now what we need to do is states right so we need to create a states and now we need to select a sets. 
because if you look at in the beginning the visualization has two colors right one is true and false so the sets will get in and out so in is nothing but the if the condition is true then is is and in else it is out the same way there it is in was named as uh, top states out named as others so create a sets sets will select top we won't we are not keeping a static top 10 uh, not the static we are going to create a dynamic using the top states so based on the sales fine okay yes in and out is right let's make uh, let's bring the stop states right side here and still see, see how it is working if i click on 10 yes top 10 states are highlighted in a blue color so we'll name it as now edit alias top and this as other okay so but still let's see how it is working for collapse oh yeah so even here also we are uh, now getting like top and others right so but we don't want it here we want to apply that sets only for the when we select expand so for that we need to create a calculated field now let's create a calculated field we'll name it as top state colors state color so if expand and collapse is equal to expand is equal to expand then I then only the set should work then expand then set else back end so if i select only expand then i should get what are all there in the set one okay so we'll replace this in and out using this formula right so if i click on now collapse it's not work it's perfectly fine and if i click on expand if I change to only five, only five st states are highlighted. Let's sort this. Okay. Oh, well, that's it. I hope this video is useful to you. Thank you. Thank you, everyone.